Cool. Thank you. My name is Tom uh, Aurel Vivida Prado. To be here in this country, love it. Thank you for having me. And I thank you for having me. A little bit, uh, basically I'm here to tell you all thank you for everything. Um, I was chose in my little country, in Tonga, to be one of the sumo wrestlers that sent by the king to Japan to be a sumo wrestler. And you all know, it's an honor for our family to have the king to tell us, like it or not, no insurance or whatever. We learned it here in America about insurance. <laughs> You're going to Japan and represent our country with all you get. So that was the thing that I left the, uh, the island at about 14 years old, 1974. And there was Kang And you know, before I go on, I, I thank God for everything that I have today and all of you. My respect to all of you is just because the good Lord blessed me with this talent that I have it for my family and all of you to be around. Thank you very much. Like I said. And to be honored today, let me honor my wife and all the, our wives for being sacrificed, for the sacrifice they take care of us, our ship, and take care of our children back home while we're on the road trying to make a living. For all the wives, thank you very much for taking care of me. I thank you for Baba, Giant Baba, for believing in me, put me in this pro wrestling. I thank you for all the Japanese people for following and all that stuff that they believe in me. And thank you for all the wrestling fans for following us as being a family. I always say this, and I will die saying this. Being left home without the family, with the war, my parents never believed in Japan, because you all know the World War II was coming outside. They were telling us, my parents were telling me, don't go to sleep. It may be the last day in your life. The whole country, we are riding on our, not the, the whole country, the little island itself. They all turned like, they didn't want the king to send us over there because they didn't like the Japanese for what they've done in World War II. But I have to tell you that there's no people like the Japanese, and I mean it from my heart. They had to do what they were told. I had to do what I was told. I was told that this is a real business. <laughs> and I'm sorry if I was stiff. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay, brother. Don't worry about it. Yes. This, one, this business, when I thank you for all of you for passing the ball to me, and this is what I wanted to pass the ball to the next generation. And I hope. I just hope. I know I'm not a good wrestler. I just hope that I was be able to run with the ball and pass it to the next generation in a good way. So I thank you and thank you and thank you. For all the people that I went to, I can't name you all, you all know me. I was started in Amarillo, Texas with the funds, believe it or not, they make me a cowboy. That's their fault. <laughs> I do. We came in, I came into this country with a few dollars in my pocket. I dropped it in Denver somewhere. And of course, Terry said, 